Okay, uh, rundown. Today is November 27th. It is Cyber Monday. Doing something a little unusual today. We're going to do a two-man rundown. Me and Big Ev. Brought to you by High Noon. High Noon El Prez pack is here featuring the top four High Noon flavors that I have. This is obviously uh, passion fruit, pineapple, pear, the new butt guy, tangerine, which is spectacular. So go out, get it, see my mug on there. Um, real vodka, real juice, 12 pack is only here for a limited time. Go get what you can. Just again, look for the pack with my face on it. The best tangerines, outstanding. If you haven't had, wake up, get in the game. You can even like do a little hologram version of me. Visit highnoonspirits.com to find the El Prez pack nearest you. Okay. Um, busy weekend of sports. Let's start it off. Uh, Tommy with, DeVito, big win for the Giants. The big, the big, the big game. Giants Pats Sunday. Michigan, Ohio State. Ev, the floor is yours. <sighs> I mean, we had it, and then we didn't have it. I. Um, Would you have it? Well, we were driving to win. After the drive, oh. where we did run it down your throat. Um, it was. It's. I don't know. It's. It's a game of inches. I mean, it was. The, I mean, the difference. That the difference was the two interceptions versus no interceptions. I mean, two very good teams. I mean, I'm just. I'm devastated. I don't. I don't know. We just fucking. We didn't get it done. We didn't get it done. I thought we were going to get it done. I was nervous coming into the game, but I was like, I was optimistic, like genuinely optimistic. Um, the defense played, I thought, s solid. I mean, they didn't make any, they didn't make stops more in the second half. They made the one, I guess, at the end to give us a chance, but I mean. Did I see a stat that Michigan has only punted once in three games in the second half? I think so. It's a problem. The defense, the last. The events this year wasn't the problem. The last the two years prior was it was it was the problem. Um, it was a little bit like the I think the football gods given the ticket that we had the, one of the better defenses I think we've had in the last five or ten years. I think we've had. I don't want to knock him because I think he actually played a solid game between the in between the two tough throws, but had probably down at quarterback over the last once we've had the last six seven years. Um, that might be a change in the offseason. We'll see. Transfer portal. Maybe Kane Holtz, this, the freshman, maybe he's the guy next year. I don't know. I don't know if they stay at McCord or not. Uh, he he just misses too many easy throws. He missed a few early in the game that held up drives. Um, throw, obviously, in the pick inside his own 20. Obviously, you can't. You just can't do that. A close game like that, two good teams, you just can't do that. And that was, that was tough to miss. Field goal at the end of the half, um, that was tough. They just didn't get it done. I mean, I just, I should have jumped out of the plane. I'm a pussy. Uh, no, 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 no. Don't be too hard on yourself. Um, saw a lot of people commenting that pregame dance thing they do. Like the guys dribbling backwards. Not crazy about it. Yeah, no. I liked them more with Stroud. Had a little more energy. I don't mind, I don't mind the offense doing it, but they don't have, it's, it felt too forced this year. I would agree. Ryan I don't. Day. I don't think what about it was when Ryan Day dances around like a weirdo in the middle. Are you I don't, okay with that? I don't mind that as much. That I don't mind. People obviously have to say a lot of things about Day. I've had his back. Well, I. Um, well, well, you said fire Harbaugh. Let's no, not. Let, I, let's I, not I, trade. So this is about not. you. Okay. So I would say. I would say overall, I've had his back. So you want to keep him? They should keep him. Yes. There's no one. There's no one out there like realistic to get that would be better. Now. What do, what do you say to the people, and I've heard this, the Ohio State people that say, I don't care if you go 10-0, you know, and 0, if you can't beat Michigan, which it seems like he can't. Well, he has beat them. You but. can't coach, though, here. He has beat them. That'd be to say he hasn't beat them would just be, like, uh, statistically incorrect. Well, since, like, five years. but He beat them. Um, five years. I th actually thought he called a pretty good game on Saturday. I don't what do you think when he, he punted on that? Play? That was the only, I've said, that was the only call you can question. I think that early in the game, and well, I was next to you. I said, I, in real time, I said, I thought he should go for it. Uh, he didn't. I understand the thought process. I guess that early in the game, the defense realistically had been the strength of the team this season. 
obviously different than prior years. So that early in the game, I guess I kind of was like, okay, like I get it. You're not trying to just – you get stopped. You give them like their uh, short field early. What did you think of the Michigan wide receiver who after the game – Said Ohio State, you know, they wear all these $1,000. Oh, that was stupid. That didn't make any sense. But you guys were soft. But, but the, because the only oh, person. Soft. Well, no, but that was, well, I mean, Roman Wilson, what, what did he do that was, like, so tough? Well, he's a great player. No, I mean, the, the guy he was talking about is a 10 times better player than him. The only person he's seen that wore the Louis V and the $1,000 is Marvin Harrison Jr., who he, I mean, he played his game. I mean, it was not. So you guys, that, that didn't so, make sense. So you don't think you him know. him saying, "Oh, you, you want to wear Louis V? You act hard." There was one guy that wore Louis V, and he played hard. Like, so don't act you like don't he's think not that you guy. guys are soft overall. No, no, we didn't lose that game out of soft. We just we made mistakes. Okay. Prior the two. You think seasons, you were tight? A lot of people saying they were too tight. The team. Yeah. I mean, McCord was tight early for sure. Yeah. He was tight early. But no, I wouldn't say no. Soft, clear. I mean, we ran, we jammed it down your throat quite a few times. I wouldn't well, say one drive you did quite a few times. Yeah. I mean, I wouldn't say that was the that wasn't the reason they lost this year. The team was was physical. What about now? This is becoming an annual rite of passage for the Buckeyes. Do you start looking and scrambling to see how you can backdoor your way into the playoff, or are you just like it's done? Uh, he beat us. Listen, he beat us listen, again to a pulp. Listen, I'd like I'd like another opportunity if if there was. How one many out do you? There. How about you? You don't think that's begging at this point to always be like, oh, we lost to our rival. No, I'd say that's not quitting. I'd say I'd be your quitter if you just quit on the season when there's – I mean, it would take a few bounces our way, but there's a potential door opening. On a scale of 0 to 10, how blue are you? I'm, I'm <laughs> sad. I wouldn't, I wouldn't describe it as blue. Blue is sad, I mean. No, no, I'm, I'm, I'm devastated. I'm disappointed. I'm heartbroken. I'm, um, Do you feel like you have nothing to live for? Yes, yeah, I do. Feel because, that like, I, I, I hand up Patriots stink, Giants stink, like Tommy yeah. DeVito. You guys would have been better off not winning that game. I don't, I don't believe that. But well, I'm, I'm, I mean, that's, but that's a different conversation. I'm just not a, I'm an anti tanking in general. Yeah. Okay. So you have nothing to live for. Correct. Yeah. Correct. I'm, that's correct. Does it make you feel any better that these hoodies, which I have, by the way, the Ryan Day on the back, will add the score? Um, it's our number one seller by a mile. People are coming I, out of the woodwork to support Barstool and Michigan, men versus boys. Michigan being the men, you guys being the little boys because we keep beating the piss out of you. Well, you people are buying these us. hoodies. It's a great, great, great hoodie. So you, you in a way, save Black Friday and all these producers and stuff and social people. You, you're Santa in many ways. I'm happy the producers are going to make some money because I went through. I also went three and two. This is not like a Frank. Yeah, I, listen, I, I went three. I, I went three and yeah, twenty. I, I saw you getting upset. From I had Friday, the bills. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, but I went three twenty and one. So I'm now legitimately retired. I don't have any money. I don't have anything to live for. I'm just broke, dead. I just a, a big fat corpse just walking around. I'm glad the producer. I'm genuinely happy. Producer going to get some money, but that other T-shirt. I um. That's about it. The FaceTime from Harbaugh after the game. Scumbag. He's a scumbag. I'll let it go. We've we've rubbed it in on you enough. Let's move on. What do you think of Michigan's playoff chances? Um, they'll probably depends who they depends. They're favored to win the whole thing. I think that's crazy. I, it's because it's Alabama, Georgia, they think I mean Michigan's it's fair. Three. It's fair. I mean just just in terms of the what you're gonna say, they have obviously a tougher game than Michigan does. Well, I think, I think it depends. I think I think they're just saying it's a Georgia chance they could would lose. be favored yeah, against could, Michigan. If they be, if they I think after they both win, they'll be the favorites after Georgia. Yes, I, they, that's I believe that's correct. I would say depends their draw. I think they beat Texas. I think, Texas. I think Oregon. Some people are saying. I think Oregon. Um, I think I think Oregon's a tougher game. Some than people Texas, are saying. I think. Uh, what is that team? Ohio State would get in over over te- Texas. I don't think so. You think you deserve it? Um, be a man. Do you? Do you really deserve it? Yeah, fuck Texas. You don't deserve it. I don't give a fuck about Texas. You don't deserve it. I mean, I think, I, I, let me ask you, I think we're a better team than Texas. Why? Who have you beaten this year? I heard this all year. Schedule, schedule. And, I mean, we beat oh, Penn State and Notre Dame. And Notre Dame. Notre Dame stinks. You didn't beat anybody. You played one so good team. We beat team. them by the same amount team. as you did. You got your teeth kicked in by one we didn't. We didn't get our teeth kicked in. You played one good team, Michigan. Teeth kicked in no, on the floor, chiclets everywhere. No, that's not true. It is. No, it's not. It's just that—that's just not true. 
Think you'll ever beat us again? Yeah, for sure. Next season. <laughs> Can you believe it? Be back in Columbus. Five years. That'll be new five. quarterback. Well, it'll be just three three games in a row. Okay. Remember, there's a point in time Jim Harbaugh was 0 5 against Ohio State. Mm-hmm. Things turn. Things swing on the pendulum. All it takes that one to bring it back. I feel bad. I, I I'm letting you get it out. This yeah, I'm devastated. I'm obviously I'm devastated. Clearly. How long will this stick with you? Yeah, uh, until we win again. Oh, well, you almost got revenge last year in the playoff. We did. That's true. If that, I mean, if we if somebody asked if we won the net, yeah, I wouldn't. I would be. It would all go away. If we got in the playoff, won the national title. Yeah, it would all go away. Listen, I'm a Michigan man. I know what we're gonna do. I've said in the past. Last year, I said. I'd like to win the playoff game. It's a good season no matter what. We won the Big you Ten. choked. But going undefeated in the Big Ten every single year and being the shit out of Ohio State every single year, okay, that, that's now I'm used to that. I expect that. I know that's coming in. Mm. We have to win a playoff game this year. Last year I said no. That, I mean, this that's year, the only thing Harbaugh This went- year the season is a disappointment if we don't win a playoff game. Last year I said it was because you guys are no longer a factor. You guys are like Northwestern to me. Uh, you guys are Indiana. That's the yeah, okay. That's this is where we're getting okay. You want to, We're getting crazy. Okay, no, I don't want. That's to, fine. No, no, no. I'm sorry. Well, I mean, if we want to speak sorry, facts, sorry, if we want to talk I'm facts. Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I mean, Jim Harbaugh. Sorry, give give sorry. a month to prepare to Jim Ed, Harbaugh, another Ed, coach, and he'll oh, lose that game. Ed, I'm not <laughs> sorry. We're not doing this anymore. What? You got your hugs out. I appreciate it. You got to win a playoff game. That's something a Harbaugh cannot win a bowl game. This is what people the guy can, see. The guy cannot this win a bowl game. People should see. It's a rivalry, but when it's over, friends. Support. You're going to lose the bowl game. You think? Probably. Harbaugh, he can't prepare for those games. He didn't even coach and we beat you. I mean, he coached during the he, week. He, we didn't even have a coach. He coached during the week. I mean, I don't think he matters that much. We didn't have a coach. We didn't have a linebacker. We, all these people, size, everything. No, no excuses. you got to admit that. We lost. That is a question. I said we lost. We didn't get our, we had our teeth. That is, a, that is a question I have to ask. Them. We lost. I don't want to keep belaboring the point. But signals this, signals that. That's what you guys all made excuses. Well, we didn't have our coach. I think Ryan Day probably is smart enough to change his signals. Penn State, same situation. Michigan's still rolling through everybody. Just well, you didn't roll. You didn't roll through. Oh, so you stayed within thirty. So what? You within thirty, I, we, you still can't beat us. Adam. We throw a pick that one. Yeah, it was at the still end. Can't beat us. We lost. So so, it validates right the last three years. Um, I'd say so. Uh, let's say it validates. You, 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 you got it this year in a close game. Mm-hmm. You got it this year in a close game for sure. C4 Energy. Right here, I could use some of it. It's hired flying around the country. Uh, C4 Performance Energy, energy that hits in the gym and on the field. Is the choice for athletes, gym junkies, and all those relentlessly seek better performances with zero sugar enhanced endurance. Explosive energy, you can feel C4. <laughs> Excuse me. C4 Performance Energy is a choice for professional athletes. Oh, Justin Fields. Oh, I just want to give you a big old hug. I mean, CJ Stroud's doing great in the NFL. CJ Stroud's on there. He's doing great in the NFL. I saw you. That's uh, You know what? And I'll finish the yeah, Garrett Wilson, John Robinson. Great players. Yeah, great, great, great players. C4 Performance Energy. Energy that hits. Find the C4 yellow can at C4Energy.com or find it near, near you at findc4.com. Um... The Ohio State Twitter account has not addressed the final score yet. They haven't said what the final score yet. Do you think, as men of honor, which I've always thought you guys were, that they should address what the final score is instead of tweeting about everything but the game? They tweet about the game. Not when it was over. Well, I mean, the game was over. What's, what's the tweet at that point? There's a lot of people following that. They're, they're following along. They don't have anything but access to this account. I mean, that's unfortunate. They... They see, look, there's a tweet about the game right there. Marvin Harrison Jr. big time catch. That's that's fact. You don't think you don't think as a man of honor and integrity they should tweet the final score? It's like you. They, they I mean, they know the score. C.J. Stroud, every five seconds, he's in the NFL. By the way, you know what? He never beat Michigan either. C.J. Stroud. Well, you guys. There's going to be. Well, you stole our signs. Well, it doesn't matter. We beat the piss out of you no matter what. They stole our there's signs. There's no. There's going to be a whole class of seniors. Who never beat Michigan at Ohio? Oh uh, well, you guys forfeited that one during COVID, so no, that's tough. they were around. They were around for that one. That's tough. 
his Harbaugh was too scared to play. He knew he was going to lose. He knew if he had lost that game, he would have got fired. Probably, honestly, that's probably the smartest thing he's done at Michigan. So I, I'll leave. I, like I didn't want to make the whole rundown about this. I'll leave it with this last question: How do you change and get better? How do you make this a rivalry again, Big O? Stop with the you know it. Stop with this nonsense of make it a rivalry. It's cute. I like the bit. I get it. It's cute. We'll see you in Columbus next year. I hope we come back. We go to Columbus next year physically. I don't know if it's worth it anymore. Oh, now it's not worth it anymore. Okay. Like you're scared. I think you already know. I'm scared. Yes. F. Yes. We beat the piss out of you every year. I'm no. scared. You're lucky to get out of there you know, when, 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 at home. You're fortunate. I appreciate it. Thank you. Hug All right. out. All right. That's the rundown. That's it. That's all I have. I mean, there's Bama, Auburn, NFL. All we care about it. Uh, that was a therapy session. Can I Better get help. Thing, Dave? Yes. Um, doing a rundown promotion for Cyber Monday. Whoever spends the most money in one order in the store today is going to be on a Zoom rundown with Tommy and Clem. So right now we're at like 280, but this will be posted later. So okay, check the Twitter account. See where we'll be at. Tommy and Clem brought out yeah. the big guns. Yeah, I like that. Everyone loves them. Yeah. Um, Help our producers get paid, please. Yeah. Contest ends at 10 p.m. Good job. One last hug. No. Good. I'll respect your wishes.